This room is very light. As you can see, there are only few apps. The developers of this room kept it clean. Not found a single unnecessary app. They have their own wallpaper called Dot Papers. I found this wallpaper app amazing. There are custom Dot OS wallpapers. Apart from Dot OS wallpapers, you can also find stock wallpapers from other cool ROMs like Lineage OS and AOSP. Now if you go to settings, you can change the theme of this app too. If you want to save your cellular data, you can set wallpaper preview quality. If we talk about music player, they kept it minimal and simple too. In terms of skin, they have done a great job. Actually, it looks cool. I have tried many custom rooms. They all have that boring music player skin. Now this skin is cool. Let's go to settings. The first thing we see is to pay with Google option. Volt is working fine. Now the real magic is here. Dot extras. You will find all the dot extra features here, which makes this room worth trying. You can change dot extras theme, customize the status bar, navigation bar change clock position, battery style, etc. In quick settings, you can customize many things, like you can set rows, columns, In lock screen section, you can find different lock screen tweaks like double tap anywhere to sleep. From recent section, you can customize your recent apps in many ways. You can add or remove clear all button. You can also change button location according to your need and show or hide available memory in the recent panel. In miscellaneous, you can find options like three finger screenshot. You can also find a screenshot, drop or share. From navbar and button section, you can enable or disable navbar and adjust navbar to the left handed mode from here you can add different kinds of buttons on the navigation bar you can tweak power menu from here now here you will get u touch it's not like a stock room i wonder why they named it u touch there is nothing like u touch Now this option is cool, it will show volume buttons when you rotate screen. In display settings, expanded desktop allows you to hide navigation buttons and status bar. You can also change quick settings color. From theme section, you can change the theme of your settings.
Here are some gestures like pressing the power button twice will launch the camera and double tap anywhere to sleep. Substratum theme engine is working. And to score is impressive. This is N22 HTML5 test score, and this one is for GFX Bench. I think the ROM is nice. Developer tried hard to make a stable and clean ROM. However, I am not impressed with N22 scores. Otherwise, ROM is fast and fluid. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe this channel for more videos like this.